What's up guys? Welcome right back to EDC Plus. Um, if you were watching the last video, you know that I had a package on the way and uh, just arrived at the door from DHL. Um, man, I ordered this on Tuesday night. It is now Thursday mid-afternoon, about 12.30, 1 o'clock, or yeah, about 1.30, and it is here. From Singapore to Southern California in a day and a half. DHL rocks. Um, get with the damn program, United States Postal Service. Um, anyways, so, without uh, further ado, here we go. box is hardcore. There we go. A lot of uh, little foamies everywhere. And I'm sure you guys can already tell what it is. Bada bing. Been looking for a nice Classier EDC watch. Uh, I've always been a fan of Seiko's. My great grandfather wore the same Seiko to his construction job every day for like 30 plus years. It was a quartz Seiko watch, just a standard watch. And uh, that thing took a freaking beating. The crown was all worn smooth. There was no. <laughs> like notching on it anymore but I mean that thing still worked and he worked construction carpenters union or every day I remember seeing him as a little kid wearing it and uh, he gave it to me now I have it and uh, it still works so I thought why not go for a Seiko All right. let's open it up here guys the uh, manual here, authenticity card, serial number, very nice. I picked this up from Creation Watches, by the way, so I uh, really recommend making your, your Seiko and Citizen purchases from them. Nice box. And... Here we are, and it is the Seiko Monster Gen 2. This is the uh, 4R36 caliber. Um, from what I hear, it's just a tad more accurate than uh, the 7S26. Um, that's hearsay though, I'm not quite sure if that's really true or not, but um, the 7S26 is an excellent movement, workhorse, real reliable movement, and from what I hear, the 4R36 is just as reliable, um, only they added a uh, hacking feature and um, a winding feature as well, so you can wind the swatch. Um, and the from the first monster what does that say Seiko Superior um, 
from the first monster, they, uh, 24 Jewel, 4 3 6 automatic hand winding, second hand halt mechanism, <laughs> diver's watch. Um, from the first one, they changed the, uh, the markers from small rectangle style to shark tooth markers, which I think suits it better for the whole monster, uh, nickname, but, um, so yeah, here it is, guys, really nice, let's check out the bezel, ooh, it's very subtle clicks, I don't know if you can hear that. Very nice, very nice watch. Very psyched about this one, guys. Um, yeah, like I said, I've been wanting a, a nicer EDC watch, and uh, here it is. Very psyched about it. Also want to pick up a uh, SKX007 and switch off between the two, but I thought this would be a good one to start with. But, uh... So yeah, there it is, everyone. Just wanted to do a quick unboxing with it. Um, I'll probably do an update with it uh, in a, a week or so, let you guys know how it's going. But uh, yeah, um, actually kind of psyched because it's my girlfriend's birthday weekend and uh, <clears throat> we're going to Disneyland on Monday and... Uh, gonna wear this bad boy to Disneyland so looking forward to that but uh yeah guys all right uh until next time take it easy